James chapter 1 James, a slave of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ, to the twelve tribes in the dispersion, greeting. My brothers, count it all joy when you fall into various temptations, knowing that the proving of your faith works patience. But let patience have its perfect work, that you may be perfect and complete, lacking nothing. But if any of you lacks wisdom, let him ask from God, who gives to all freely and with no reproach, and it will be given to him. But let him ask in faith, doubting nothing, for the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea, being driven by wind and being tossed. For do not let that man suppose that he will receive anything from the Lord. He is a double-souled man, not dependable in all his ways. But let the lowly brother rejoice in his lifting up, and the rich one rejoice in his humiliation because he will pass away like the flower of the grass. For the sun rose with the hot wind and dried up the grass, and its flower fell out, and the beauty of its appearance perished. So also the rich one will fade away in his ways. Blessed is the man who endures temptation, because having been approved, he will receive the crown of life which the Lord promised to the ones loving him, that no one being tempted say, I am tempted from God, for God is not tempted by evils, and he tempts no one. But each one is tempted by his lusts, having been drawn out and having been seduced by them. Then being conceived, lust brings forth sin, and sin, being fully formed, brings forth death. Do not go astray, my beloved brothers. Every act of giving good and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights, with whom is no change or shadow of turning. Having purposed, he brought us forth by the word of truth, for us to be a certain first fruit of his creatures. So that, my beloved brothers, let every man be swift to hear, slow to speak, slow to wrath, for the wrath of man does not work out the righteousness of God. from the world.